Hey, it's Frankie Lane. We're here at CinemaCon 2024 in Las Vegas, Nevada. We finally got Michelle to the show. We're going to be walking around the show and having a lot of fun. What's up, Michelle? Are you ready to see all the latest movies and all the gadgets that are coming out? I'm so excited to be here, so come check it out with us. Frankie Lane from FuturePreviews.com. We're at CinemaCon 2024. Michelle, what movies are you looking forward to seeing this year? I'm actually really stoked to watch Beetlejuice and The Joker, this movie right here. I know. I can't wait, right? Yes. It's going to be dope. You said... Um, Todd Phillips. Yeah, and, and Lady Gaga. Todd Phillips is, is, is uh, directing and uh, uh, it's a musical this time. That's crazy. You can't wait to see it. I can't. I'm looking forward to seeing Lady Gaga. Yeah, me too. So it should be a huge hit. Okay, so make sure to go see it. It's coming out October the 4th. And uh, take your friends and go see it and check it out. And we're here with Destiny and is doing a contest. And she's actually going to explain to you guys a little bit more about it. So... It started off with you sent a script in and they received over 900 script submissions and then ours got chosen and then we were actually already given $20,000 to then make the spot. So we got to work with an incredible budget, we got to organize a team, we made it in six months and every day we were working on this project and just to make a sweet little 20 second commercial. So it's 20 seconds? Yes. Just a baby, just a baby commercial, just really super short and sweet, and it was incredible, like working with everyone and the mentors and all the crew together, and then um, they narrowed it down to, from the 900 scripts, to just four teams to give the $20,000 to, and then, yeah, and then now we're going to compete to see who wins the grand prize, which is... If we win, then our commercial gets to be shown across so, America. What were you doing in the video? I was the director. Oh. Yeah, this is actually, behind us is an image of the final product that we made. Yeah. Well, I hope you guys win, honestly. The, the grand prize is our film will get distributed throughout theaters everywhere. And so our video would be shown. So that would be the grand prize. Right. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm so excited for you, and congratulations. I hope you win, okay? Thank you, yeah. It's called Signs of Friendship, and we're just so grateful for this opportunity. I'm Adam. And I'm Destiny. Enjoy our Coca-Cola refreshing film spot. I'm so excited to meet your friends. Frankie Lane from FuturePreviews.com. We're in a Coca-Cola booth. We're in with the filmmakers, man. They're up for the award. There's like four of them left, and somebody is going to win a bunch of money. Why don't you guys explain to them a little bit? Denzel, you start off. Explain to them what's going on. Yeah, so this is the Coca-Cola Refreshing Films Program. Uh, my partner and I, Naomi, were from Humber College. We were finalists this year. Uh, we were given a budget to produce a 22-second uh, Coca-Cola spot that celebrates the magic, the real magic of the movies and the movie theater experience, and that's what we did. Okay, so what is your little short about? Can you tell me? Yeah, okay. so our spot is called Auditorium 4, and it's about three friends who are getting their drinks, their Coke and popcorn, and they're going down the theater, and as they pass all the doors, oh sorry, they're going down the hallway, and as they pass all the theater doors, the movies are spilling out of the door, and the anticipation and the magic of the theaters is just overwhelming and they go and see their main feature and are refreshed. Nice. And so you guys are down. It's the last four. There's four people left, right? Are you guys all excited? Are you excited? We're thrilled. We're thrilled. This like experience as a whole has been super, super momentous for us. It's been a, a great and a thrilling time being the only Canadian team this year. Um, it's just been like something that we've never done before in such a big scale as well, so it's been really exciting. Okay, I'm gonna get questions for both of you, so hold on. Start with you. What do you wanna do? 
you win the award, what do you want to do? What do you what do you want to do with your life? Okay, if you're ready to graduate college, what, do, what are you going to do? Yeah, um, what do I want to do? I uh, so I'm a director and a writer, um, and my goal is to write for write and direct film and television. Um, after doing this, I'm also really interested in directing more advertisements and things like that for for brands like Coca-Cola. But uh, ultimately, my 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 biggest ambition is to direct for film. Nice, yeah, nice. You'll do it. <laughs> Steven Spielberg over here. Okay, how about you? Um, so, having produced the spot and after graduating, we both graduated from Humber College last year in Toronto, um, Canada. And um, I actually launched my own production company called wow. Fifth Line Productions. Wow, look at you. Yeah, so hopefully I'll be doing more stuff like this. Okay. More clients, commercials, short films, features. Um, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Good for you. So you guys be looking for them, okay? We're going to run the uh, little commercial that they shot, and hopefully they'll be the winners. But you know what? They're winners already. They're here in Vegas in the Coca-Cola booth, and they're going to blow up and be big. So watch out for them. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hi, I'm Ben Zah. And I'm Naomi. Enjoy our Coca-Cola Refreshing Films spot. You'll be in Auditorium 4. <sighs> We're in the Coca-Cola booth with John and Charlotte. They are one of the Coca-Cola winners, man. They're here in Vegas, and uh, their actual short film is one of the winners. And so we're gonna find out if they're gonna win the whole thing. Okay, listen, John, tell me a little bit about the film. Actually, tell Michelle. So um, the basis for our film is that there's a group of friends who dress up to go see their favorite superhero movie, and they kind of run into their rivals slash villains about to go to the theater, and they kind of have like this like little standoff of like, ooh, like what are you like doing here? And um, after that little standoff, the villains are just kind of like, like you know, and then they're just kind of like, you know what? After you, like you go, you guys go in first, and they show that little act of kindness. And then um, they all just kind of, they're like, okay, like, you know, the heroes are like, okay, like, these guys are pretty chill. And then um, they go and enjoy the movie together. Hey, nice. nice. So what is your part in this? What did you do? Did you direct or did you, what did you do? I was the writer and director. You're the writer and director. That's huge. Yeah. That's huge. Did, did, it, did it come together easy or was it hard to put together? Um... It was, I would say both, like our starting, our fir very first script to our final product, there was definitely a lot of version, a lot of changes, especially working with such a brand, with a major brand like Coca-Cola. So I learned a lot in what we can and can't do and very specific things. It was a lot of fun. Okay. Okay. So, okay. The other question is, what are you going to do after all this is over? Um, I don't know yet because this has definitely brought in my like... Because I thought I was just going to go to straight live TV, but this is, I love doing this commercial. Like, this was so much fun for me, and I can definitely see myself in the future doing something like this. But you can see yourself being a director and, yeah. and a writer for, for movies Definitely, and stuff. definitely. Nice, good for you. Open a lot of doors for you. Okay. How about you, John? I am going to finish school. I have one more semester after this, and then I'm probably going to go into live broadcasting, hopefully in the beautiful city of New York, and just live my life to the fullest. I wish you guys nothing but the best of luck. You're already winners here. Uh, do you have a name? Do you have a name for the uh, for the, uh, the spot? Yeah. What's it called? It's called Super Connections. Okay, so we're gonna show the, the commercial right after this, and hopefully they're already winners. But hopefully they'll win the twenty grand. Twenty grand, Michelle. Twenty grand. Hopefully they'll win the twenty grand. And there you go. And you're in Vegas in the Coca Cola booth. You're already winners. Okay. So congratulations, you guys. Uh, thanks for sitting down and talking with us. And. Um, <laughs> Oh, wait, real quick. Instagram. What's your Instagram? Um, you can follow Super Connections on Instagram. It's Super Connections with two S's at the end. Okay. Our production Instagram is also is Super Connections. Okay, awesome. There you go. Follow along, and uh, hopefully they'll win the whole thing. But if not, like I said, they're already winners. Thanks for logging on, everybody. We appreciate it. FuturePreviews.com. Michelle. Hey. Hi, I'm Charlotte. And I'm John. Enjoy our Coca-Cola refreshing film. Hi guys, we're back again from Future Pre. 
previews. My name is Michelle Stefania, and we're here with Jose. And behind us, we have the DeLorean Back to the Future. Time machine. Time machine. So Jose's gonna explain a little bit uh, more about the car. And I'm pretty sure you guys already know what car this is. Um, and also, explain your shoes a little bit. These are the Nike Air Max, as uh, worn by Marty McFly in the uh, Back to the Future movies. And so we're wearing them to honor the film and to kind of uh, fit the vibe of uh, having a DeLorean time machine here at the trade show. Okay, can you ex explain a little bit more about the car or like what you guys have going on? Well, we're ACS Enterprises and uh, we uh, are a theater cinema service provider. So we decided to bring in the DeLorean time machine to kind of uh, celebrate 20 years in this industry, kind of giving back a little bit to uh, an industry that's given so much to us. And it's been 20 years uh, with ACS, so we're here with the entire team, and we're here to just kind of celebrate the movies and CinemaCon and everything that we do. Awesome. Thank you so much, Jose. Thank you very well. Visit us at uh, www.acs-ent.com for more information on the services we provide. Thank you. You heard it here first. All right, when we go into the movie theaters, man, we got to hang out with the Cheeto dude. You got to get some Cheetos, some popcorn. The Cheeto popcorn is the best, okay? So you sit in the movie theater, get you some Cheetos and some popcorn, man. What's up? We're with the Cheeto dude. CinemaCon 2024. Michelle, the Cheeto dude. <laughs> <laughs> Stephania back from future previews and we're actually here at the Tivoli lighting booth and this is um, such a cool vibe so basically what they do is they do the atmosphere in the theaters all the lighting and everything like that so you can catch a vibe so get into it <laughs> Hey, it's Frankie Lane from FuturePreviews.com. We are in Las Vegas hanging out at the Advanced Sim Racing Booth. Whoa! <laughs> I'm gonna wreck this car. Anyway, uh, this is part of D-Box and I'm bouncing all over the place. Listen, I'm gonna give this to Mark and Mark's gonna tell you what's going on and how you can get this. Can you get this in your house, bro? <laughs> okay, hold on. I'm just messing up. Hold on. Let me do this. Okay, let's go. Yeah, absolutely. You can get one of these in our house. So, I mean, our my company's called, uh, I have a few partners, with Advanced Sim Racing. So, what we do is, what you see in front of you here is a super high-end racing simulator device. So, we go all over the country, all over the world, really, and install these high-end simulators uh, for professional drivers, wealthy enthusiasts, you name it. Uh, we can do pretty much everything. And we're here at CinemaCon now uh, in partnership with D-Box, which D-Box, obviously you can see here, if you look down low, are the motion actuator components. So while he's racing, he's getting dynamic feedback and the actuators are actually moving and throwing him around a little bit. Uh, so yeah, what we're here for at CinemaCon is we've developed a uh, super self-operated and optimized device that allows people in cinemas and the cinema owners to purchase this pod we call it so you see there's two units with multiple people around playing at the same time and all people have to do is sit down tap their credit card and they're ready to play so it takes a super complicated high-end racing simulator and makes it into a super fun easy to use device and you don't have to be good you can just have a ton of fun run around and hit as many walls as you want it's all it's the best part of simulation you do not need to worry about damage as we can see this there's a good example oh wait you just missed the wall good job there so uh yeah i mean the best of racing has been uh, up and going for about four years now uh we've worked with some of the greatest and biggest names in, in racing as well as some uh enthusiasts enthusiasts that want to have these in their homes i mean typical pricing for a full simulator like this that includes full d-box and everything will be between twenty to forty thousand uh, uh, dollars, so it's a, it's a big thing. But it, once you get into it, it's hard to it's it's hard to get out of. So uh, yeah, thank you so much, guys. Hey, it's Frankie Lane from FuturePreviews.com. We're hanging out with Advanced Sim Racing. 
Uh, we got Mark racing the car for us. We're in the D-Box booth. And Mark, you can actually get this in your house. Of course, yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, these units, I mean, Advanced Sim Racing has been doing this for about four years now, and these units are uh, designed, we've been installing them all over the country, in the U.S., America, and actually all over the world, and yes, uh, we, we specialize in delivering them in your house, fully turnkey service, uh, uh, so that basically all you got to do is get in and play. Okay, so I got to ask you, how much is the cost? So, yeah, I mean, a unit like this, we can do pretty much anything. Everything is very customizable, but the typical unit with the full D-Box motion you see here moving around and the full service is usually going to run about thirty to $40,000. Uh, however, if you're willing to do some of the work yourself, um, I mean, you can get something for starting at ten grand. So, and we're still talking something super high-end. So, uh, I mean, the budget can be from ten to $150,000. There's really no limit. It is great, man. It's so much fun racing this thing. I had such a blast. So what do you what do you actually do for them? Do you actually design this? So I'm one of the partners over there, and what, I'm the sales vice president of Advanced Sim Racing. But we have a full team of designers. Uh, we have a few of the owners here as well uh, uh, at uh, CinemaCon, and it's a, a divide and conquer type of business where uh, we're getting a, a much bigger than we are, but we're still very very much involved. Uh, and uh, one of our owners is. The uh, main job is to the design of the chassis and designing new products and coming up with new great things. Uh, uh, well, uh, again, I handle the sales part of things and business development. So yeah, we're all very excited to be uh, uh, to see how much growth the company's been been undergoing over the last few years. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's fantastic. If you guys ever get a chance and you're down uh, in the movie theater and you see one of these, man, you gotta go jump on this thing and race it. Or if you can afford it, buy it for your house. Cause it's a blast. It is definitely a riot. That is for sure. Yeah, I mean we can we can do uh, uh, pretty much any car, any any sort of track. If you have a local track around your area, we'll be able to, to set it up for you. Uh, so oh, so yeah. you can have you can set race tracks up for them too. Of course, it's it, ultimately it's a computer. It's it's gotten super high end now, and we have the knowledge and we work with real professional drivers to help us hone in these simulators and make them a super, super accurate. That's the big part of this, uh, is basically being able to drive any race car you want, any racetrack you want in your living room or your man cave or you name it, uh, uh, we'll, we'll install it anywhere. So yeah, we, uh, we're, we're, we have the knowledge now to be able to pretty much do anything. If you want to race a, I don't know, 77 Trans Am on the Pacific Coast Highway in California, we'll set that up. You'll be able to do that. Wow, that's so cool. Yeah. Mark, man, thanks for spending the time talking to us. Thank you so much, man. It, it's, it's, a, it, it's a riot, man. It's, it is so much fun. Okay, you guys, thanks for logging on. We appreciate it. Make sure to like, subscribe, and follow. Hey, hey it's Frankie Lane. Uh, we're at D-Box hanging out. Uh, what up to my boy Mario, who works for D-Box. I'm sitting in one of the seats. It's like, it's like bouncing around. It's actually moving. You know, we're watching Little Avatar, and... The seats move and it is so cool. Okay, so when you and get to a movie theater and you see D-Box, make sure to sit in your seats or buy tickets for their theater that has D-Box in it. Okay? That's what's up. FrankieLaneFutureFreebies.com. God, this is comfortable. It's Frankie Lane. We had a blast, man. We're here at CinemaCon 2024. We've been walking around, seeing all the popcorn and all that stuff. We've been going to the presentations. We've been seeing everything from Beetlejuice. There's so many cool movies that are coming up that you're going to get a chance to see this summer. So make sure to go to the movies. Thanks for logging on, everybody. We really appreciate it. For Michelle Stefania, I'm Frankie Lane. Thanks for logging on, everybody. Tell your friends about FuturePreviews.com. Like, comment, subscribe.